What it do, YouTube? It's your boy J Man Flow, aka Mr. Let's Get It Let Go Go Go. Bringing y'all a uh, most highly requested video: How to use quick adjustments. They always say, "Hey, how do you adjust everybody while you stay on one person or or while you stay on one user? How do you do that? Like, how are you manning people up and you still on the same guy?" I'm gonna show y'all today. But be sure to like, comment, subscribe if you're new to the channel. You know what I'm saying? Hey, but if you're new to the channel, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Uh. Oh, that's all I'm saying. Oh, my bad, John. My bad. I'm tripping. Like I said, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. We roll to 100K. We still going on. Thanks all y'all for getting me as far as I can. This would not be possible without any of you, and I love y'all for that. Let's get into this. This can really, this can be used in any formation. Three, four, odd. Uh, three, four. If you four, three dollar, don't matter. Four, six. You can use this with anything. I'm gonna just show y'all the nickel, uh, like a cover two type thing, just from a nickel. Like I said, we gonna pick a random play. Da -da -da. We just talking about quick adjustments. Da -da 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 -da. Boom, 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 boom. And like this, this takes a lot of practice to get really good at. People are like, yo, how do you do that so fast? Like, and it, like you can know how to do it, but it's, it's going to take like a lot of time for you to get used to so you can do it faster. But the first thing you want to do, if, you on, if you're on PlayStation, it will be uh, triangle. If you're on Xbox, it will be Y. You double tap Y, boom, boom. That's how you control your DB. So you see, I'm standing on this linebacker. If you double tap Y, I can man up my DB. So like, if I double tap Y, hit Y Y, hit A, and then like, you see how all the all his assignments pop up. So you can put him in a deep zone. You can QB spy him. So I'm gonna hit up on the right stick, man coverage, RB, boom, just like that. Y'all see how easy that is. Now he's manned up. We set the play. And then that's just how you do that. You can you can man up anybody. You can do this. And then once you get good at it and you get used to it, you can basically cross man the whole team if y'all want to. Like I'll see how that works. We're gonna reset the play. Like I said, hit double tap Y, boom, or double tap triangle. You can even you can even you don't have to just use this to man people up. You can pit someone in the zone too. I double tap Y. Let me pit this that flat in a purple. Let me pit both flats in a purple. You feel what I'm saying? Just like that. Let me pit them back in a flat just like that so like i said you don't have to click on him like it's the same adjustments you would do like if i click on him to man him up i would have to click on him hit a man coverage rb i had to click on him hit a man coverage zoom but with this you just have to use your quick adjustments boom like it, and that's how easy it is now that's how you control your db so your db is either a cornerback or a safety so you can control and nickel you have three safeties or three corners out there so you control this corner this corner or this corner and these two safeties now your linebacker, you're gonna double tap RB. Let's reset the play. Double tap RB, and you see how my linebacker, I double tap RB or right bumper R1 if you're on PlayStation, and I got four buttons that pop up because I have four linebackers out there. So once I do that, now I can I can quick adjust with those, boom. Just like that, so hit RB or R1 twice, boom, boom. Pick your button, whichever linebacker you wanna man up. So if I wanna man up this guy right here, I'm gonna hit B, man coverage, RB. That's exactly how that goes. Now he's man up on RB. Or I can hit B, man coverage, and put him on Beasley. It's it's that simple. And then y'all like, okay, so now we know how to control the linebackers, and now we know how to control the DBs. How do you control everybody else, the defensive lineman? You're gonna double tap L1 if you're on PlayStation, or left bumper LB if you're on Xbox. You hit LB, and now we only have two defensive tackles in because we have, so we can hit X. I usually like the only I usually only use that to put them in a spy, so I can hit LB LB X boom. And like I said, this can help set up a lot of blitzes. Cause like if I say if I wanted to send a blitz, like uh, uh, do that, that, and then spy my D tackle, boom, like that. I, I don't have to move off my user, or I can, or like even if you just like setting up a blitz, like this just saves so much time. Cause then if you do get quick hike, if you do get quick hike, you're still in your user instead of trying to move to different places. Cause a lot of people they go to adjust their line, they get quick hike, and they're like, oh, I got quick hike, you know. But if I, if you're on one user the whole time. So I can do boom, 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 and man him up, and then I can stay on this guy. So even if I do get quick hike while I'm making my adjustments, I'm not really mad because I'm still on my user and I can help control and help with a lot of stuff. So that's why you want to do that. So that's how you use quick adjustments, and this will help with user and too because once you know how to use quick adjustments, you can know what you have to use. So if I man this guy up on A, and I man this guy up on RB, and so then I man this guy up on X, so then now the only thing I know, like, okay, now either... Cole Beasley can run a slant or I'm watching a running back. So now you know, and now since you know you only have to watch two, two people, your users are going to get a lot better because you're not worried about nobody on the field. So even if they run a ball, I'm only worried about the running back because, like, you see how everyone else is cross-man. Like I said, 
this will help everybody in the future learn how to do this the more you do it and the more you practice the better you'll get at it the faster you'll get at it like because a lot of y'all see me cross man and people like that and they like yo how do you do that like how do you do that so fast and it's like it's just because from a lot of practice but sometimes you're gonna mess up at first like you it's, it's gonna be hard like getting used to the buttons like it, and if you, if you got a messed up controller it's gonna be hard at first but like i said i hope y'all enjoyed this let me know what other tips y'all want to see but until then it's your boy J Flow, aka mr let's get it less